The Netherlands won 15-11 in that pool play bout earlier this week. And here we have Trevor Crabb and Theo Bruner in the white tops on the left side of your screen. On the right side of your screen in the blue tops, that is Stefan Bormans and York de Groot. And we have quite a rally to open things off. And here's de Groot, that really nice fluid left side approach. Goodness gracious. And Bormans, as Bormans, he's just, he's so big. I mean, he's six foot eight, but he just moves his hands so well. He doesn't jump crazy high, and there you have it. There's that beautiful left hand work from Stefan Bormans. And there is that high line from Trevor Kraft. 49 more types of line coming at you. George Groot to get to. Oh, that's just beautiful. Beautifully done from Stefan Bormans. He is so athletic. He gets so far over the net with his press, but Bormans is known kind of for a, a Y or a spread block. Watch his hands here. The super wide, really nice move from Bormans. Nice hands on that. Line there's Trevor Crab chopping that cutty off. Oh, beautiful serve from York to Groot. My goodness, this has been surgical. And there is the ace serve that the Netherlands didn't even need. That any time a team of equal talent beats a team worse than 21 to 12 in the first set that they never win the second at the moment it is the kind of the the energy war right now of who can come out with, with a little bit more in, in the second set not this first set is over but it, it's a bit of a formality at this point And that is a huge block from Theo Bruner. I know I said I was excited of that blocking out, but here's that big, big outside the body press from Theo Bruner. As the Netherlands staying firmly in cruise control, up 13 to five. Nice turn by Theo Bruner. You can hear the line angle. That line swing hit the end and the sideline. It doesn't get any better than that. And there's a huge right hand from Theo Bruner. A little bit of life coming back. Second block, watch this right hand. Boom, spreading that. We haven't seen DeGroote try to turn one line just yet. And that one is going to make him think twice. And there's Theo Bruner again. This one covered from Bormans. Opportunity coming in transition. Can the Americans bring it back to within five at the tech? They cannot as Bormans gets blocked number three. On Theo Bruner, I mean, well, they've been earning a lot on both players in this one. It's been a, a defensive earning spree for the Netherlands. And there is York de Groot, the beautiful judge. Look at Stefan Borman, such an entertainer. A couple years ago, uh, I played in the United younger up-and-coming player in the Dutch Federation, and he's just such a fantastic partner. And he's just always keeping the energy so high for his partner. The match is trending in the right direction for the Americans, which is all you can really ask for going into the second set. Nicely done by Theo Bruner on the pull dig. Again, it'll just be a free ball incoming in transition. Nice, fast play down the line. Trevor Crabb made a good move on that, had a good read, good break. Nicely done from Trevor Crabb. As I mentioned, 50 shades of lime. We got about 46 more to go. With his good friend Triborn switched over there, and he is awfully comfy. But when you see him on the left, man, it's just fun to go down memory lane and see just how good Crabb still is on that left side. And there is York de Groot working a little magic. You just hear Stefan Borman. Now, here's that magic number for Theo Bruner. Hey, he's at that 12 point mark. This is where it. He always says that if you beat a team worse than 21-12, we're going to come back and win the second set. What a shot from York to Groot. Netherlands up 20-13, to 13, at least seven more set points to go should they need it. I highly doubt they will. As there is York to Groot, Nutmegging. Trevor Crabb, 21-13 is the Netherlands winning set number one.
They, they took almost a full year off, and they do not look like they took even a second off. That was awfully close to an ace serve. Oh, Trevor Crabb almost got it. He was in the perfect spot. It's almost alarming. Just another really nice defensive play from the Netherlands. And that's just how this match has been going. The offense gives him, which at this point, at this point was enough to win the first set 21-13. Nice move from Crab. Bruner can't quite get it up. Out there on center court, La Paz. And there is Stefan Bormans again. My goodness gracious. His hands are just so... Put him up there with Robbie Muse. Actually, I'd probably put him a, a hair above Robbie Muse. Apologies, Robbie in terms of just a, a pure blocking standpoint at, at the net. Now, that it, beyond that, the list is going to get awfully crowded. But Stefan Borman, he's just so active at the net. He's just, his hands are everywhere. Not only are they everywhere, but they're strong. And speaking of good, strong hands, Theo Brunner. And the group somehow it wasn't touched by Stefan Bormitz, a swing or a shot. He's, he's just so active out there. And York de Groot just can be so patient in defense. And there he is on offense, so smooth, lobbing that cut shot right over the top. At some point, you have to test out Bormitz at least once or twice just to get de Groot out of a rhythm, passing just to get Bormitz setting, just to make them do something different. And there's Crowd, that is a beautiful. And there we go. They finally switch up the serving. Going at Borman's get a decent opportunity. But still, it was something different. It was something unusual for the Americans. I'd expect them to keep it on Borman's for at least a little bit longer. There's Bruno. Nice clean side out. It's the American side out game. Get a lot cleaner as well by Borman's on those lateral moves. Back to De Groot. They go. Perfect pass. Perfect set. Really nice swat from Theo Bruner. Big opportunity, and oh my goodness, guess who's home, ladies and gentlemen? That is Stefan Bormans back at the net. But again, Stefan Bormans is just so dang good at the net and so active as a blocker right now. De Groot just so patient in defense, and what a swing and distraction there from Stefan Bormans. De Groot all over the cut shot. Oh my goodness. A defensive clinic is being put on. And they remain so here, getting a big and useful error, and a rare one. This has been a very clean match this far in terms of errors. And there is Bormans again. He is just dominating. At this point, when both Dutch players are playing so well offensively, you just got to hit your best serve. I, I'd expect Crab to keep going down that right side line, switches it to the seam. And Theo Bruner, big move into the angle outside of his body. And so a lot can happen, but if these two are healthy and they are playing like this, oh my goodness gracious, Yancy! Goodness gracious, good night move. Huge swing from York to Groot. Welcome back to the beach, young man. to keep the American spirits high. Beautiful deep angle swing. I don't know, 30 minutes. Nicely done by Crab. Huge opportunity in transition for the U.S. And there is that man again, Stefan Borman. Big move outside of his body. Just put that DJ tune. First match point as the Netherlands are looking to make their way into the medal rounds. And there is Stefan Bormans. How else could this match have ended? How else could it have ended? As Bormans got a dig in transition, sent it back over to the U.S. and then just blocked it for good measure. As Stefan Bormans just put on an absolute limit.